So this is Superior Wizard. I'm using the arrow keys to move around and the keys on the numpad or the keypad or number pad to cast spells. It looks like this. And uh, so I'm going to show you how to cast fire. Left, right, left, right, up. That's fire. And um, as long as you can remember that combination, you've got the spell. You can use it at any time. So you run around with the spell, and then when you're ready, you, you shoot it off in some direction. But there's actually more that you can do. You can also control it after you've shot it off. So that makes for some pretty interesting combat. Um, you can kind of bring it to a stop, you can keep it moving with you, or you can just let it go in some direction. And you can't move and cast at the same time. So if you're trying to cast, you stop moving. And that makes for some pretty interesting fighting. Like With friends especially, it, it, it's a lot of fun. Like Some really interesting gameplay comes out of that. So. I'm going to show you what it's like to fight a bot. And they're pretty smart, but they're not as smart as a real person. So um, they've got to dodge spells and try to cast spells at me at the same time. So they've kind of got to balance those two things, which is pretty tricky. And here's a water spell, left, right, left, right, down. And it's slightly different to the fire spell because it's a bit more maneuverable. It's a bit a bit easier to control. So you've got to kind of decide what you want, like speed or control. And then you can, if you know fire and water, if you remember the combinations, you can pick either one of those. So um, you can kind of fight anywhere, anywhere you want, and you can press backspace to get someone to join with you. You can also have uh, someone playing with you with a controller. And uh, you can fight each other, or you can just explore together. It's up to you what you want to do. And so you kind of learn new spells by talking to characters in the environment, or, or from your friends who've learned the spells. And uh, you're going to find them in the environment. So here's the fire spell. Um, someone actually teaches that to you in the game. And Or you can get a fire spell by walking through this altar. Or um, somewhere else. I won't say where, but if you explore a bit, you'll find a healing spell. And uh, that's what I've got at the moment. Um, there's a bit more to see. If you look around, here's a spell book which shows you fire and water. And um, that's kind of it for now. I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you see the potential that I see in it. Thanks.